you can use Nullify's task management as a way to assign to-dos to different users in your account. If you click on Tasks in the home screen, you'll see a list of all current tasks assigned to you. You can add a new task from this screen and type in what needs to be done and the deadline of when it needs to be done. Then you can assign it to a specific job and phase as necessary. And then you can select which resources in your account this task is assigned to. When a resource is selected, you'll also have the ability to include additional comments. And when this task is saved, it'll send this user an email letting them know that a task has been assigned to them so they can see when it's due and mark it as complete inside the system. Some users will also have the ability to change which task they have the ability to view based off of who it was created by or who it's assigned to. In this case, we can view tasks created by anyone, which will let me view all tasks, and I can see what still needs to be done and what its due date was. To mark a task as complete, you can click the circle with a check mark inside it next to the name of the task. This will email the person who created the task and who was assigned to the task to let them know it was completed. We can also view tasks inside the plan and track section of the project. We'll want to toggle the setting in the top right corner to view dates and progress instead of cost versus budget. And you'll see a tasks option inside each phase where we can see what tasks are here mark them as complete, and you can see more information about when they're due and who they were assigned to. We also have the ability to add tasks directly to a phase using the Add New Task button inside Plan and Track. And if we want to see all tasks associated with a project, instead of just seeing them on a phase-by-phase -phase basis, you can open up the summary page of a project, and you'll see the total number of tasks assigned to this job and how many are pending and need to be marked as complete. And you can view all tasks associated with this job by clicking on the number in the total column. If you have tasks that are commonly being created for all jobs, then under the task screen, you can go to Manage Task Dictionary and create a list of tasks that you're commonly creating so you don't need to manually retype them every time. This also allows you to include default comments and default assignees if it's usually the same person completing these tasks. Once the task dictionary is built, you can open up any project and go to the summary page and click Add from Dictionary. It will show a list of which tasks you want to include. You can select them and it will automatically load in the description of the default assignee and you can enter in the due dates for this specific job and which phase this task is associated with if necessary. When we click Save, it will automatically create a task list for this job without us having to enter them one at a time. They'll be set to pending for these users to mark them as complete.